Welcome back. It's Tips and Tricks time, Tips and Tricks Monday. Today's trick is about IntelliJ, Git, and browsing through Git repositories as specific revisions. Let's find out what that means. All right, so I'm in a project, an empty project. It just has a main method, hello world. And imagine that I'm creating a new class, which is called Quarkus. And I'm printing out something, hello Quarkus, something like that. And then I just commit that, uh, the Quarkus commit, not the best commit message, but it will do, right? And then my next commit, I'm thinking about, ah, I don't want to get involved with uh, Quarkus, so I'm going to delete it again. So I deleted, deleted Quarkus. Right, I commit that. Now let's have a look at the version control window. I can see my initial project setup with the main method here. I can see my Quarkus commit. I can also see my deleted Quarkus commit and here in my project browser, I see no Quarkus class. And what I can do is when I highlight a commit, I can right click it. I can obviously check out the revision. So then I'll just get the exact revision checked out in my project folder. But what I can do if I don't want to check out the revision, especially in bigger projects, I can have a look or just show the repository at the revision. When I click that, I see a new project pane opens up and I can see I have my source folder, main and Java. And I can just simply go through it and see what's going on here. Hello Quarkus. And that is quite nice. If you want to browse a repository at a specific revision, you don't have to check it out, but you can simply browse it. Quick caveat, it takes, if it's a huge project, it takes a while because IntelliJ has to do a lot of while well, fetching uh, of specific folders and whatever, it doesn't get your whole directory tree at once. But other than that, it's quite a nice and nifty feature. All right, that was another Git repository trick, IntelliJ trick. Next up, a couple of more hardcore Java tricks. Stay tuned.